So we can see the Byzantine castle with Comalty Knee at a different angle now. So here's a, a circular tower. Wow, look at this. That's a restaurant, by the way, that's built right next to the castle. So I thought that it was like city walls, but obviously it's not a city, it's just a town. And it's not, it's actually a castle. This is a Byzantine castle, not fortification walls that are defending a city. So the castle is, by the looks of it, a square shape. So we can see here, another tower here. So this is another tower. You've got a tower there, a circular tower. And we've got a tower here. And interestingly, um, I was quite disappointed to realize how this tower was mostly destroyed. So, uh, shortly after the Balkan Wars, when obviously the Greeks liberated the city from the Ottoman Empire, uh, a Greek leader of this place, Comatini, he decided to destroy the castle, which was, you know, it's, it's his history. It's, it's a Greek leader. I mean, this is a, you know, you can tell it's a, it's a Greek fucking place with Greek culture and history and architecture and buildings of heritage. Like, it's your heritage. Why would you destroy your own castle? So he destroyed his own castle in his own town where he lived and was the leader of because he, he wanted the, the building materials because the building materials of this Byzantine castle were very good. Obviously, big rocks and big bricks and everything else. Why would you... Why would you destroy it? Just, just find the bloody materials somewhere else. So he got the building materials and he built a load of houses and a load of other buildings with the building blocks of this. So I think that is a bit stupid, really. I don't think... It's very good of him to destroy his own castle. 